Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel, The Flamenco Coach. I'm Belinda Retamal, your Flamenco Coach. I am here to help you take the scary out of improvising for Bullerias Pod Fiesta. One of the ways we do that is first of all learning how the letra works. If you don't yet know how the letra works, I will put a link in my description. I have already made a video on just how the letra works, so make sure you go and watch that because today I'm here to take it to the next level. My last two videos I posted how to come in with a remate, with a six count remate and a 12 count remate to coincide with the caída, which is in the second sun line. And today we're going to look at a two compass remate. So this two compass remate will generally fill up the whole entire second sun line because a second sun line takes two compasses. And if you're Remate also takes two compasses, then you will be finishing at the same time as the singer when the singer resolves with the caída. As long as the singer isn't doing anything fancy, if they're just singing it straight, that is the idea. And that is the most common way the singer will sing it when there is a dancer improvising in a poor fiesta situation. The only times they tend to start being very fancy is if it's just on a recording or they're doing a solo. So we don't need to worry about all of the ifs and what ifs and possibilities. Let's just focus on the most common way and get ourselves nailed down with that. And then after that, we can worry about what else might happen. So let's now have a look at the 24 count remate or two compasses. If you haven't learnt the six count remate and the 12 count remate, I will link my other two videos below. So go and learn that remate because that's going to be the last part of this two compass remate. So we're just building on the remate each time. I'm not teaching all new steps. We're not here to be super duper fancy. This is more about learning the techniques of how to come in and improvise. So with that, let's have a look at what the step is. Let's take a look at the two compass remate. It will go. Breaking it down with the counts, it will be 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, so that's the fast version. Let's break it down. I will face the back and teach you the remate with the counts. So we're first of all going to be coming in on count 12 with a stamp on the right. And then we're going to do another stamp on the left and then another stamp on the right together. And we're going to do a little jump back. We're doing right, left, right, jump. So the counts will be 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So that is 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then we wait count 6, 7, 8. And then on count 9, 10, we're going to do stamp, stamp. We have 9, 10, and on count 11, a little jump onto the left. So it can just be in place or just a little bit back. So it's like a little spring just to go down here to prepare us to go into the next uh, step, which is count 12. So from the top, we have 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And the arms that I'm putting with the step, you can choose whatever arms you like, but I'm going to do on the 12, bring my arms to my right hip as I'm doing my right step. 12, 1, 2. So on the left, count two, we're doing to the left hip. So we start with right hip, left hip. And then we have 12, 1, 2, 3, Five. So after bringing to the left hip, we can just bring them down and around behind our back. 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Let me just see what looks good. 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So we'll go 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then 
and then we're going to bring our arms just to the front. Nine, ten, so they're ready for eleven, twelve. So they're already there for the clap on count twelve, okay? So we have twelve, one, two, three, four, five. Bringing them around to the front. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that last 12 counts I did teach in the last video. So I'll link to that one if you haven't learned it yet. And you can just go back to that one, learn that part, and then come back here. So just from the top, we have 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, so that is the two compas remate. I will put some solo compass music on, we'll practice it to a slow one and then a slightly faster. And then I will put on a bullerias letra and we will practice improvising to come in with the second sound line. Let's go. Okay, let's practice to some slowish solo compass. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten.
hope you enjoyed learning that two compas remate and practicing it with a letra. I have linked the music to the letra down below so you can have a go at it yourself. And if you do, let me know in the comments how you go. Also, if you have any questions on Bulgaria's Port Fiesta and improvising, let me know in the comments and I can make a video around that too. If you like this video, please give it a nice thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because I will be coming back with some more tips and tricks on how to improvise for Bulgaria's Port Fiesta. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.